for me, I guess, uh, I just like trucks. Um, I've had uh, different trucks and four-wheel drives my entire life. Um, I've always been kind of a bigger guy. I'm really not into the hunting and fishing aspects of it, uh, but I've always had a, a four-wheel drive that I could take and, and uh, drive down the road through snow. And you know, being in the northern part of the country, we get that a lot, and uh, you just feel a lot safer in a truck. Um, when I got hurt, I was forced to be in a minivan because that was the only thing available. And I really went kicking and screaming. Um, I had uh, uh, kept my SUV as long as I could and uh, finally my wife said, you know, we, we just can't keep trying to make transfers and loading wheelchairs, the whole process is too long. And so I was forced into a minivan. Well, after about eight years of minivan uh, therapy, I uh, finally was able to get into a truck. And uh, um, I didn't realize at the time how emasculating it was uh, to be stuck in a minivan. Uh, but as soon as I got my truck back, um, I just couldn't stop smiling. I mean, it was a it was a great moment going down the road and being, having my truck back. It just felt like I got a part of me back. Uh, so I guess I'm a guy that uh, associates himself with his vehicle as much as a, a lot of guys do and, and, and girls too. So uh, for me, I really like the truck. Uh, the all-terrain conversion is just an awesome conversion for somebody in a wheelchair. Um, it not only allows you to do all the things that, that a truck has the capability of doing, uh, but uh, when you're loading up, you know, the, the gull wing door keeps you out of the rain. Uh, when you're on the lift, the speed of the lift going in and out, uh, it's just, you can't uh, imagine the difference when, when you have something that can go that fast and get you in and out of the vehicle. When you're running errands and stuff, you don't feel like you're holding everybody up. And uh, so it's, it's just kind of a little thing, but it weighs on you when you have to uh, take a long time getting out of other vehicles. So, um, and then the other thing with the all-terrain conversion is just the durability of it. Uh, you know it's going to work every time you push that button. You know the door is going to go up. You know the lift is going to work. Um, you don't have to worry about taking it on the road and being somewhere where it's not going to. Um, and it's a very simple system, so it has very few moving parts. The parts that do move have been designed and tested over the years in a variety of applications and uh, the build is meant to run like 10 million cycles so uh, you're just not going to wear it out and uh, you know that uh, when you're out on the road you don't have to worry about it and uh, that's really a big thing. Uh, people not in wheelchairs, you know, if their vehicle breaks down they can call a cab or they can call somebody to come and get you. Um, but when you're in a wheelchair uh, you don't have that luxury. I mean, there's not a good way to get me and my chair in another location except for in the vehicle that I'm in. So uh, you definitely want to have a vehicle that you feel comfortable with and especially if you venture far from home. And that's what the AT conversion brings to the table.